in less than two bus lengths. Which means that at peak times, it's perfectly safe to schedule buses to run at 20 second intervals. Look what happens when there are bricks on the guideway and the bus hits them at 100 kilometres an hour. Nothing. The guide wheels keep the bus perfectly on the tracks. If a guide wheel is broken, the bus will stay on course. If there's a flat tyre, the guide wheels keep it on track. This must be the safest passenger transport system in the world. But if for some reason a bus does break down completely, we have special double-ended recovery vehicles that can push or pull in either direction. If there's some kind of blockage on the track that could take some hours to remove, trains would have to stop. But O-bound buses simply drive off the busway at the next interchange and take an alternative route. That's flexibility. Where would you position your bus stops along the track or your large interchanges? You simply design them in where they'll do the best job. In fact, you could design in places where buses could actually drive off the busway as part of a schedule to become like a normal bus, driving around the local streets, then back on again at another place. It's almost a door-to-door -door service. Currently, 80% of people board or alight from the buses in suburban streets. It works superbly. Then the bus turns around and enters the busway again for the return trip to the city. Imagine the flexibility you'll have. No rails to tie the vehicle to tracks. And too accessible to vandals. The Oban is as flexible as you want it to be. No ugly wires overhead or dangerous power from below, both very expensive to maintain and too accessible to vandals. No expensive power to be installed along the route. Oban buses are self-sufficient. Little or no pollution. And they're virtually silent. Oban buses can be environmentally friendly in every way. An Oban is cost-effective to install a fraction the cost of rail. Compared with rail, it needs less signalling and buses can work more closely, making rush hour travel management that much more efficient. And it's also simple and cost effective to maintain. Again, a fraction the cost of rail. An O-bound system offers all the benefits of light rail with all the benefits of comfortable air-conditioned bus travel. It can give every city the passenger transport flexibility it needs. It can speed people to and from a city centre without a change of vehicles, unlike rail, where people need to change from feeder bus to train, and it lets them alight at the usual bus stops. For proof that it works well, the Oban is the only form of transport in the entire Adelaide bus, tram, train, Oban network that has increased its patronage every year since it commenced operation. Every year, more and more Adelaide people are discovering how fast the Oban is, how comfortable, and how much more efficient. And the Oban is fun. It's a tourist draw card. Transportation professionals and enthusiasts come to Adelaide from all over the world to ride on it, to experience it. The Oban was invented in Germany.